Hey guys, it's Dread Frank here, and welcome back to Super Paper Mario. I haven't played this game in like two months because I'm a lazy piece of shit. So I don't remember if I read that or not last time. Maybe I did, maybe I didn't. We're up to chapter 1 3 the sands of Yold. Ha, <laughs> Yold, Yold. I forgot how humorous this is. Did an old man watch it say something about there being some ruins around here? Yeah. The pure heart can't be far now. We better not waste any time. Yeah, let's go. Let's go. Oh, look, I'm so dude. What's what are my controls? Uh, how do I flip? What's my flip button? That points at the screen. As you can tell, I haven't played this. Okay, whoa. Okay, this is jump. That's throw. That's flip. That's nothing. Understandable. Have a great day. Oh, there's all those blocks that I missed. This is a speed player. Temporarily speeds up time. So in triple points and coins while it is active. Whoa! I'm on speed! Oh, this is a zombie shroom. I just murdered it. This is very difficult to control. Oh, the rock! Oh, I want to. I want to know what the rock does. It's... That's a bold cleft. You might just confuse this rock, hard foe, with a rock. Max HP is two attack is one defense. No, yeah, attack is one defense is two flames when scratch this foe. Set off an explosion there to flip it over, then it'll be vulnerable to an attack. Yeah. What if I throw my dude at him? Aha! You don't stand a chance. Oh, he stands a chance. Did I flip to get up there? Maybe? Card behind this rock. You got a squig card. Yay! What are you? That's a brick- no, no, I don't care about the brick block. That's a boombox that blasts cones of pure sound that anyone that doesn't like. Max HP is 4, attack is 2, gets startled by its own loud noises. Okay. Oh, this man- this man can just heck off. He can just heck right off. To the desert- nope, no, nope, nope. we're on this way. To the desert sands with you! Welcome to your die. Ow. Flip. Oh no! Oh, uh, we're fine. I cannot be slain. What? What is this thing? Dragon? That's not a dragon at all. It's a fucking. It's a diamond. Jawbus, they tend to bite anything near them. That's such a fire attack is one so maybe this is the glowing spawn on its back. Who'd have thought it? Maybe it is stuck. Okay, maybe it is a dragon mine. Or it was just a happy little You think it'd turn around when it was being assaulted. No, nothing nothing flippable here. There's a rock. I'm gonna jump on it. Yay. Uh, I've assaulted a rock. What new adventures await us here? Something behind this. Nope. Jump. Is that a, is that a flippable? What? What is that? Why is there a floating pair of pink testicles? That is a cherubble. It's a nasty gas bag that spews a plume of sleepy gas. My fish is five attackers too. Put me to sleep. It's a giant floating butt. Yeah, doop yeah. You've been saying. So this is, this, I'm, I guess the gimmick of that Goomba is that it flips. Do I get a unique thing about it?
this one says this one can flip. Oh crap, I'm gonna take the show already. It is Wednesday, my dudes. Yeah. Die, criminal scum. What is that thing? That's a rock shell. Courage shell. Briefly reduces the damage you take by it. Oh, that's 50%. Bro, no. Yeah, go in the go in the sand of death. Where's the door? Where is the door? Where is the door? Where do I go? Do I need to be flipped? Did I just miss it? Am I a fool? Ah, that rock has an arrow on it. I'm gonna run out of flip! Ow. I've run out of flip. Gameplay. What is this? The old signpost. Find ye tall red palm tree of fortune and leapeth under its branches ten times. Sure. Sign. Just, just do that. Can I fall off? No. Right. So, red palm tree and jump underneath it ten times. Back here? Do I have to backtrack back here? This palm tree is not red. If I misread the sign, I don't remember a red palm tree. I feel like I may have misread the sign. Let's say red man jump under. No, no, there is a red palm tree, sweet. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. He's a genius. And more of these spinny boys. Oh no! It's a venomous mushroom of death. I bested it, however, for I am great. Super Mario. How am I supposed to get onto that? We flip to 3D, walk to there, and then does it save our location in the third dimension? It does. I still can't jump there. I guess this is a puzzle? Or maybe I just suck. No, I don't do that. Oh wait, is the, the trampoline still exists. Oh, well, it's too far away for it to be of any use to me. Hmm. Truly is a predicament. Two hours later. Is that like, do I jump around it? You know, that was a lot easier than I I was making this out to be. How do I? Oh, I don't step on it. I like, I just pop it. Oh, I was meant to just stand there and throw the thing at it. <laughs> I'm a genius. Uh, they call me Super Zav Man Master of Puzzles. You can call me, call me the, the, the Puzzle King? Damn it. 
Actually, before I go jumping on this save block, let's save. Why do I have to suck at platforming so hard? How, how hard can this jump really be? First try. What's oh, a, a 20 hit point mushroom? Ah. No, I'm just gonna take a point of damage. I don't even care. You can, you can. Oh, I didn't even take damage. Some of the greatest Paper Mario player of all time. There's no, there's nothing there. Yeah, look at that min maxing. He's up in the pipe. That was like what, eight thousand years for four coins? Value. Gargoogly. So you're the lad sticking his stash in me boss's business. Why have I made him Scottish? I'm guessing this is O-Chunks. It's O-Chunks. He was originally offensively Western. Now I guess he's Scottish. You shouldn't have crossed the count. Now I'm gonna have to get chunky on you. You're, you're one of Count Black's thugs, aren't you? What is that? This man is a, a legend. Oh, Chunks is me name. And I'm no common thug lass. I thug for the counter counts. Count Black himself. One word for me and Blacky boy, and I come to the beginning yeah, feeling. <laughs> what? I can't read it. It's too good. Ham hamage. Yeah, make that damage. He's thinking. He's the thinker. Whatever then. Nothing it matters. A pinch of stew in a sandstorm. You're a goner. Donkey. <laughs> You even know what Count Black is trying to do? Damn! <laughs> Me boys using powers and whatnot to bring back some... some order in Tissier world. An enemy of Count Black be an enemy of mine. Then get chunked! This uh, chunk is a lot scarier than the other enemies we fight. No, he's not! He's not scary at all. He's the single greatest man to ever live. Enough is enough already. It's time to thunder down from on high and deliver a beating all the ages. Chunk on it! Oh, oh, I hit him. Oh, oh he's, he's chunking. He's hitting me with the, with the chunk mobiles. Oh, oh god! Help. 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 What are you doing? Don't you mock me. Ha! Ah. Oh shoot. What happens if I flip? What does he do then? Do we just get really confused? No, he's he just sort of accepts it. Oh, I should wait, I can do this. That's our chunks. He's a big bearded warrior of a man. Max HP is 20, attack is 1. So it's 20. Can I throw? No, not flip. Throw. Throw. I hack him. He is mine. So, did he flip if I flip? That's what I want to know. There he goes. 
All right, listen, Hero Trunks, you are mine, criminal scum. All right, now that I figured this out, I've discovered the boss fight is significantly not difficult in the slightest. I'm chunked, me chunks. You failed me. I got pummeled by a, uh, and you barely sweated your brow. Eh, what kind of strange little man are you? This strange little man is none other than the legendary hero, Smario. Mario, eh? Tis an odd name, but you beat your, <laughs> you beat your baby. I remember that. Oh, Chugs, you're my favorite. It's not Mario. It's Mario. You clod. You remember this, Mario? <laughs> if you didn't look like such a wee toddler, I wouldn't have taken it so easy on you. But eh. <laughs> <laughs> I have to give it up for your efforts, so let's call it a tie. <laughs> How about a draw? <laughs> and while you're at it, why don't you wax that bony stash of yours, Maria? <laughs> You've offended the stash. Chunks away! <laughs> I sexually identify as O Chunks. The door. What's in the door? Oh, it's a sign. Parcheth ye atop the distant platform of blue, the following for the eyes of the hero only. Gaze ye at the side of the stone push. Press minus and one at the same time to make something interesting happen. Oh god, what's minus? No, that's of no use to me. Alright, okay. Give us a second. I need to check my controls on the emulator. <laughs> One minute, 37 seconds later. Help me. Help. See, this just brings up the controls, and if I... To make something of interest happen. Is this it? At the same time, what's one? Is it? Is that one? Wh am I real? So it's meant to. Be, it's these two buttons. I can. I've confirmed. So it's this and this at the same time. It does nothing. I've been lied to. This sign has lied to me. I refuse to believe that this sign has. Whoa, it's the blue one. What's the blue one do? An ice cherry blue. It's enough to guess, but it's just please guess. So this one, this one freezes you. Can't freeze me if it's been defeated. Oh, whoops, didn't mean to do that. Oh no, it's all over. I've ruined everything. in one at the same time. I'm... Did I look at it wrong? Did it tell me to press a different button and one at the same time? I'll... What are frogs? Is this a... No, it's not a pipe. Oh, What is it? If I, if I flip, it's pretty much the same. Is this where I meant to press 1 and minus at the same time? It was at this point 
that Xavier figured out where to press 1 and minus at the same time and did not spend upwards of 10 minutes trying to figure out the easiest puzzle in Super Pepper Mario. Oh yeah, of course. Understandable, have a great day. That was realistically a lot easier than I thought it was. Woo! End of chapter! Yes, I would like to save my progress. Save complete. Yay! Somehow, Mario found the strength across the desert's sweltering dunes. The head was a sprawling content Contents? Complex? Sprawling com- Yeah, okay. I, I was thinking of complex in the wrong context there. Of ruins! Rising out of the sand. Thankfully for the shade, Mario and Tippy ventured deeper inside. They were the very ruins Old Man Watchit had warned them about. What dangers lurked in the shady corridors ahead? I don't know. How about we find out next time on Super Paper Mario? See you guys, Jared Fangat, and cue the music.